Escape rooms are all the rage right now, but they're not exactly cheap. Now the Aurora Central Library has its own escape room, and it's free. Dom Dominic Garcia went to check it out and found that these days libraries offer so much more than just books. So these days, your local library ain't your local library anymore. It is much more than just books. Enter Aurora's escape room. It is an affordable option for people, and the people who put this together had so much fun doing this. When Monday comes back around, I'm happy to go to work. And why wouldn't you when part of your job is building an escape room? Nothing in here can be Googled to be solved. Nothing requires previous knowledge, just the way you think. It's the latest project Aurora librarian Brandon Foreman and his co-workers have cooked up. And then it was just a brainstorming session of different ideas and we settled on the haunted carnival. And uh, just from combining our strengths and what we can do, that's how we came about with this. This room can be found at the Aurora Central Library, and it's free. They see these advertisements for these cool programs, and they're sure there's a catch. You know, like escape rooms, those are usually $30, $40 per person. There's no way it can be free. It is, and it's just another example of how libraries are changing. When the clock strikes midnight, you are out of time. They're usually imagining an older librarian at the desk going, shh. Um, that is far and gone in the past. But more and more, libraries are becoming a community resource and one that's affordable. You have single mothers, single fathers out here working 8 to 12 hour shifts all day, trying to put food on the table, trying to keep the lights on. The least they can look forward to is someone that's looking out for them, want to provide that free service and a memory. That's where things like this escape room come in. We offer free programs like this all the time. We offer programs on how to buy your first car, how to manage your credit uh, correctly. All for free. You have to come check it out your library and see it for yourself. So this escape room goes until November 6. Again, it is free, but there is so much more the Aurora Public Library is doing. They have Pokemon stuff, beer tours. For a complete list, just go to our website at cbsdenver.com. In Aurora, Dominic Garcia covering Colorado First.